Here are some instructions for you if you will be bicycling with us. There will be a formation of bicyclists riding by an audience and at different times you'll be making different noises and the composer specifies which noises to make at which time. When you are approaching the audience and when you are departing from the audience you'll ring your bell and then while you're driving by you'll make a variety of other sounds. If you go to the website you can see the score and descriptions for all of these sounds. So the ringing the bell there are three notes. The one F means kind of loud and short. Then there's two F's which means a little louder and the other little lines mean do it a number of different times. And then the third one with three F's means wicked loud and you do it as many times as you can. And this you do while safely riding towards the audience and then away from the audience. And you have to imagine 111 other bicyclists doing it at the same time to get this wonderful sound cloud effect of these events. Then, just before you get to the audience and the spectators, you're going to whistle and sing. By the way, the word divisi is an Italian word that means divided. So we don't want everybody whistling at once or everybody singing at once. Some people will be whistling, some people will be singing. Just decide. There's two kinds of whistling. There's whistling while exhaling, which is like this. And then he wants you to whistle while inhaling, which is a different sound. And if you want to practice this, you can go in, out, in, out. He doesn't care about the specific pitch, but he wants them to get higher and higher as you go. So an instance of doing this might be... And you can hold it, and then... And then higher. We don't really care about the pitches. It's just the height and the sound and the joy and the happiness. Also, right before the spectators, you will be singing. And he wants you to sing three long, high sounds. You can sing them falsetto. You can sing them just anywhere high in your voice. And you'll notice from the score that there are three vowels, an A, ah, an E, and an O. Oh. They're all pretty loud, and they all have a space in between them. So they go, ah. A, O, or if you're extremely adventuresome and you wish to sing falsetto, you can go, A, E, O, anything like that will be just great. Also, you can repeat these things. You'll see there's little repeat signs on each of them. So you do those three notes and then you can go back and you repeat them. And then while exactly driving by, uh, they, you make the quietest sounds and this is the cool part of the piece. The loudest sounds are farther away, the medium sounds are as you're coming and right when you're driving by you do the two sounds that are slightly quieter so actually the volume should be roughly the same for the audience and the two kinds of sounds you make are the four long high flutter tongue sounds and flutter tongue just means go if you can't do that I guess you can do like that. Some people can't roll their R's. It's actually genetic. You can go and then take a breath and go and again the two F's mean fortissimo which means to play wicked loud. So you can go and notice again that there's two notes and he wants you to hold one, go to the other, take a breath, hold one, go to the other. Then also when you're riding by them, he wants you to imitate gusts of winds. And these all start very soft and get louder. And you can manufacture three different ones. And it sounds like shh. So you can do this. You can go shh, shh, shh. And notice he wants the middle one to be the loudest. So let me recap all of these sound events. Here they are again. Here's the ringing of the bells. There's three different kind of bell rings. There's the short one, then there's the louder one, and then there's a really loud one. If you have a twisty bell, you can maybe do this a little easier. Then also as you're approaching, right before the spectators, you're whistling and singing, and the whistling is and you can repeat it. Notice you don't have to sing the same pitches. Then you're singing as you're approaching. Oh, yee, Anything you like. Uh, then right as you're going by the spectators, remember the flutter tongue. And the gusts of wind. There's three of them. The middle one is the loudest one.
And when you are departing from the audience, you'll ring your bell. It'll be quite an event and we'll see you there.